Guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, as we can see, Europa League is finally back. Um, it's probably going to be the same as last time since it's happened before, um, where you play against other teams in the group stage. Um, usually, there's going to be four groups, and hopefully, United and Wolves, I think it's going to be, uh, will be in it as they weren't in it last time. And hopefully, there will be some interesting plays um, from United. Maybe, hmm, who, who would I want? I probably want a Rashford or a Harry Maguire, something like that. Um, or Daniel James. Actually, I reckon a Daniel James would have been the best one. A left mid Daniel James would be an uh, amazing one. Uh, but you never know. Since it's Europa League, it could have one of the like rising stars like Angel Gomez and that. Since I support United, I hope there will be good United players. As you can see here, uh, you've got the rules. So it is the same as last time. Let me just go through these. Um, ooh, look at that ox. That's going to be a really good card that I want for my Premier League team, especially I got the centre mid position. Um, I saw United in the group stage, so that'll be good. We got um, Jay, but that's got Rome. Oh, that's a good card, you know what? That's it. That that probably would be a good card if you use a Bundesliga team. So um, it's the same as last time, and that's a really nice card. So if you have a Bundesliga team, you definitely want to go for him. But I want to check the players there are because I saw a huge list, and that's a lot. So ooh, Mason Greenwood, look at that. Wasn't expecting that, but not the best right mid card. Obviously, a right mid should have better crossing. Uh, I'm going to look for United players, and there's Cody from Wolves. Um, Wan Bissaka, that's nice. Look at that card, that's gonna be really good. Real Patricio, and then I want the Ox, but realistically, you can't get him without paying, which is another problem from FIFA Mobile, is that they just care about money. Um, so there's not a United player that you can get from completing the group stage, which is pretty annoying. Um, but I'm probably gonna play the matches quickly, and I'll speed it up. So I won't waste any time, so I'll be right back afterwards. All right, that's all of it done. So judging from this, that costs all of my stamina just to play four skill games, and I only got eight of those tokens. So, and this whole event is like a week, I think. So it's pretty much a pay to win if you want one of the good cards, which is really annoying because I think the best, I'm gonna figure it out for the next video, but um, I gotta figure out which one is the like best card you can get for free to pay without using any of the gems. Uh, real money or your FIFA points so that is a really annoying thing but you get a lot of coins to be fair for 10 of the tokens so you know that's uh that's another really easy way to make coins because these players you know they're not going to cost a lot unless they're from a prem premier league or bundesliga and Serie A, something like that um but that's it for this video there's not really much else and it's just pretty normal so i'll see you guys in the next video hope you guys enjoyed it